Hey guys, it is Vivids and welcome to my first episode of the Prime series here on RizCope 2007. Now, I'm not sure if some of you are familiar with my The Prime series. Now, I've tried to do it on RizCope 3, but, um, you know, the series didn't go very far simply because I didn't have any goals. You know, if you're watching that series, I'm not sure if many of you have watched that series. But, um, you know, my goals were really, really ambiguous and clear. Now, personally, I wanted to achieve... Um, you know, I wanted to achieve the construction of the best account, you know, that you can make of RuseCape 3. Maybe not so much, you know, getting the most experience in the game, like 5.2 build total experience, but basically just getting the best gear and getting a lot of money. So if I was ever, if I was to ever do a PVM such as Virago or Nex or um, Calfire King or anything like that, I've got the best gear and I can just go hang out with some friends and do that. Now that was the ultimate goal of the Prime. But um, what I've noticed when I was making that series is I don't really enjoy doing stuff when I don't actually have a complete set goal. Now, now obviously, I'd, I had somewhat of a goal to achieve, obviously, the best armor and things like that. But, you know, from my experience playing RuneScape, the most fun you can have out of this game is achieving levels and, you know, achieving... Going from like a newbie or a newbie -er account to achieving something that's quite, you know, quite fantastic and quite um, and quite great. But throughout this entire series, I'm going to be keeping you guys updated on my stat levels and things like that. Now, the ultimate goal, I guess, for this series is to get an account that's like a main account. So I'm going to keep uh, probably get 99 attack, 99 strength, and a bunch of other 99s. Hopefully, that that's a, that's the obvious goal. Um, with 70 defense so I can then PK and use my Barrow's armor and things like that. But one of the most entertaining things that I ran into when I was playing RuneScape back in 2007 was um, was just doing Barrow's and just doing PVM and stuff. Now back in 2007 I could only just do Barrow's and you know with that said I couldn't do God Wars, I couldn't do any of the other main bosses and things like that so I did miss out. So I guess the point of this series is to get a good account so I can then go do Barrow's and then go um, work my way up to do the higher tier PVM like Armadil, uh, Bandos, maybe even Kraken Boss. I guess we'll see that. But then again, the Kraken Boss is more of a Slayer task than a boss. Um, but there's all these different thoughts running, running around in my head. Um, but I did want to make a sort of progress video series for you guys because I found that the, the, the most fun I get out of making videos for you guys is sort of uh, making progression series. Uh, for example, if I was to do my... Uh, my monthly bank videos, which just some of you may remember. Um, what I would do is just to recap, I would just make a bank video at the at the start of every single month, showing you guys how I progressed through that uh, through the month. I would then show you all my statistics gained and you know some of that sort of stuff. But um, you know this is going to be the intro clip to this uh, the Prime series. Hopefully you guys enjoy you know the few level ups and things like that. So I've taken a few pictures and some uh, recordings of my level ups because I wasn't quite sure what I was going to do with these level ups but I thought I'd just note them down just in case I needed to use them in the future. So we've got uh, 36 Slayer, we've got 37 Slayer and all the way up to 42 Slayer um, which is quite a nice little achievement and we also managed to get I believe it is 64 strength on uh, on film as well as 65 wood cutting and uh, 62 range. So there's just a couple of uh, a couple of little clips there for you guys. Now I'm going to get on to the rest of the video. Alrighty, so we're back at cheerleader. We're going to get our next task. We've just finished our lesser demons task. We are currently only 500 experience away from 41. And I guess what? Well, let's have a little look at what our closest milestone is here. Nothing too crazy. Blood vels at 50 would be nice. Equipment though would probably be more beneficial for me. We've got Slayer Gloves, Leaf Bladed Spear, probably... I guess the main thing that I'll be able to use next will be um, maybe Durodel, the Slayer Master, and the uh, the Slayer Dart spell, which would be absolutely fantastic. Let's see what we get right now, shall we? The world starts to shimmer. Why is the world starting to shimmer? No, that's right. We need to speak to Cheerleader. That's all right. 166 Cockatrice. So that's, that's going to be not too bad, I guess. They're in the Relic of Slayer Caves. Let's get cracking with those. And I'm also nearly 65 strength, so that should be always good. And my current goal for the uh, the Prime series right now is to acquire 65 attack and 65 strength to allow me entrance into the Warriors Guild. And once I've done that, I'll be able to get myself the Rune Defender. And I'm basically just working at getting the best gear. So once I've completed that, I'm going to probably work towards getting the Barrow's Gloves. Uh, maybe get the Rune Gloves first, and then maybe the Dragon, and then eventually the Barrow's Gloves in the future. But we need to train our stats up, of course, first. Off to Cockatrice we go. Nearly there. This teleport, this teleporting to Camelot and walking the rest of the way is kind of killing me. I need a Slayer Ring so I can teleport back to the caves. I need to see, actually, how I get the ability to do that. I think it's like a few hundred points to unlock the ability to get the, uh, the Slayer, the Slayer um, Ring. It goes to show 
you know, it's been a while since I've played 07, and it's been a while since I've done much Slayer on this game, so I would really love to get my hands on some Slayer rings, but at this stage, it looks like a little, little distance from now, so... Oh, I could have just used the fairy ring. I need to find that code because that's going to be the most useful way to get here. But then again, where's the closest fairy ring to me? Maybe... I'm not sure, but I'm probably going to use the fairy ring in future uh, future tasks that I need to enter the Relic of Caves. But at least we're here now. We've walked up. We've ventured up from the Cathabi uh, teleport spot and let's kill us some cockatrice. Here it comes... The Rambo for the... Oh, missed it. Come on, I'm so close. 28 experience. There we go. 65 strength. It's time to switch up to attack and get me 65 attack. And here is the last cockatrice. Or cockatrice for 41 slayer. Which will probably get us nowhere, but... Let's have a look. Yep, nowhere, but another level closer to 55. And at 55, I want to use a magic dart. And eventually go to Barrows and start making money at Barrows. So I'd have to say the best thing about the Cockatrice task is probably the drops. Although the drops aren't too spectacular, you do manage to get quite a few Limpet Roots and quite a few Herbs and things like that, which is quite good. So they're going to be good for future uh, Herb Lore training and uh, future Crafting training. So that's always good. Okay, so let's have a little look now what task we get. So there's 11k bugs, I believe that is, which is not going to be very good, but uh, let's see how it goes. And what a coincidence that is. It's 43 Slayer on the last kill of the um, of the task. That's always nice. 12 tasks in a row, 10 points. Time to return to Cheerleader and get me another task. Okay, so we're back at Cheerleader, trying to grab me another task quickly. Let's see what we're going to get. Um, blue dragons, that's a nice little change in things, I'm going to go probably collect those dragon bones and those dragon hides, I'm going to use those dragon bones to train my prayer up, I think, I'll see, and the dragon, uh, the dragon hide will get me some more money, so that should be lovely.